Good morning. Aloha, everyone. Tea Candy here, Universal Orlando. First full day. Doctor Doom's Fear Fall, an Incredible Hulk right there. Hollywood Rip Ride Rocket, the Lilla. Aventura, Cabana Bay, and Volcano Bay. Most of the view is terrible, but I'm glad to see all of that. Let's go. Let's zoom in. The Hulk. Red Red Rocket and that little tower right there. That's the entrance to Islands Adventure. A little lighthouse. Alright, going to the lobby to get my pass. I'm ready for Universal. This is a little crooked, but also 11 runs in the first inning, game three against yeah, Atlanta Braves. I love it. Let's go. Here's a view from the elevators. There's the dock side in, which has yet to open. A giant lake. Also, a couple notes about this hotel. The beds are really small. They're doubles. Eh. So I slept in the living room. Jalen took the bedroom because I want her to sleep. I snore. And also, just the beds are small. And the two soda machines in the tower, no water. And only one of them had Coke Zero. So that's a problem. A couple of other th little things here and there, but. I'm back at the lobby, so let's go get my pass. So excited. Finally, a pe Florida pass holder for the first time, and it's universal. I don't even have a universal Hollywood pass. I'm excited. Here's the line in the lobby waiting to get tickets and passes and all that. Starbucks might make a stop over there for Jay and myself. Myself, of course. <clears throat> so we are taking the car to Universal because the line for the bus was kind of long and we didn't want to be in a bus packed full of people. And this is much more relaxed. We have our masks off. We're in the car. AC. It's nice. And we don't have to worry about the buses coming back, being packed full of people, waiting for the buses. We will have to take the bus tomorrow. Yeah, bus to Volcano Bay, that'll be fine. Wow. This sucks. Come up right from there. We, you this sucks. <laughs> oh my God, was that a cluster. And I don't necessarily blame Universal, necessarily. It's a bunch of people don't know how to stay back Dude, like guy away right from here people. Against his back and against my back. Like, yeah. Uh, but city walk. We're almost there. We got to go pick up our passes. So you know what? It's on us. We came to a theme park during a pandemic. But for goodness' sake, like follow the rules. Well, no. We feel comfortable. I, but I, I feel comfortable with the rules that are in place. Yeah. People need to mind those rules for others to feel comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. Mini golf. Oh, yeah. I'm going to just put this on me. Yeah. Oh, and right now, I really don't feel comfortable. I, I kind of want to leave, but I'm calming down. <laughs> but again, that's not Universal's fault. It's just people are not adhering to the rules that are just so but, simple. But none of, the, none of the employees are saying anything. We yeah. have so many. In fact, one lady was like, hustle, 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 hurry up, hurry up. It's like... Eh, yeah. Anyway, it can only get better. <laughs> right? It can only get better! The heart of City Walk. Yes. Going to Islands Adventure. Yeah. Islands is Gotta get our passes. Right. Now officially Universal Orlando annual pass holder. Both me and Jalen, yay, we're going into Islands Adventure. Here. I haven't been here in five years. 
so excited. Look at that new roller coaster over there. Uh, we're starting our day in Seuss Landing. And I remember this ride being super creepy. Super amazing. Uh, reminder, this is also Jay's first time at Universal Studios Orlando. Pass out. So, yeah. We did also get one day express for single use per ride, but they didn't do anything, so we might get to do it again. But I forgot how cool this queue is actually. There's no one here. This is great. Made us jump. We looked and we saw him step in. Oh my god, so creepy! And we saw him, the cat in the hat. That cat, go away. You do not want to play. He should not be about when your mother is out. Oh. Why, we can have lots of good fun if you wish with a game that I call Up, Up, Up with a Fish. Look at me! Look at me! I'm the cat! I don't want to! And a cake on the top of my hat. Ooh! 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 Oh, that's a cool effect. Do I like this? Oh, no, I do not. I will pick up the book. You will see something new. Two things. And I call them thing one and thing two. Oh, no, 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 no. They will come here to play. They will keep you so they will have to Your first Universal Orlando attraction, what do you think? It didn't involve video screens. It was great. It yeah. was an actual attraction. It had one. It, it, had one. it wasn't like Hollywood where it's like video, 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 yeah. video, video. Yeah. Here's our first view of a U.S. area where you can sit at a table, take your mask off, relax. But we're gonna go on. I think this is one fish, two fish. And uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do everything. We got Express. Why not? Two quick notes. We're in a two seater. Not all of them are two seaters. Single seater, single seater. Tyler's in a single seater up there. Hi. <laughs> but uh, also, what's really cool is this is our second attraction. They give you hand sanitizer personally as you get onto attraction, which is pretty cool. Like, I like, some hand like yeah, sanitizer. that's actually really cool. So, props for that Universal. So far, after security and that whole debacle, so far this has been great. But we're in Seuss, which is a lesser populated area. We'll we're see what. Town. Yeah, we'll see what happens when we get to Harry Potter. But your fish we'll ride see. is now beginning. <laughs> also, you can control up and down. So Jalen's got the control. Oh, we're going down. It's bright. Ah, we're all the way down. Careful, because they're going to spray us. Because apparently you get wet on the suit. Oh, there's the water down there. Oh. Oh, there's more. This song is this song is great. Oh, there's water up there. Oh no! <laughs> Got us a little bit. Seated until you're swimming. Oh, that was kind of fun. Now unbuckle your belt and exit your seat. Yeah. Run, skip, hop, no, or jump. I'm sorry. Just walk on. Next, we're going to do the high in the sky Seuss trolley train ride. Sneech is in. Roll trains. We're ready to ride. Oh, there's a nice breeze out here because of all the fans. We are green eggs and ham, tater tots, and whatever. <laughs> it's It's hot. And Jay and I are sharing the buffalo chicken tots. That's what Tyler got too. And we also got the Coke Freestyle refillable cup. So $17. Coke Freestyles throughout the park. Refills unlimited. Yes. Buffalo chicken tots. Looks good. Um, safe to say we hated it. 
did not enjoy it at all. <laughs> Just kidding, these are fantastic. So good, green is in him. Thumbs up. We're waiting for food. Sup guys. So here's our first look at a socially distanced meet and greet. She just went behind the uh, leaves right there and she's just waving at people, so that's pretty cool. Not only are there a bunch of fish staring at us, there's a troll under this bridge. Oh wow, he sounds angry. And look at this view. That's great. And here is a great view of the new Velocicoaster opening next summer. Wow. Look at that inversion right there over the water. That's crazy. I'm looking forward to this. I've never done Poseidon's Fury. Someday. Unless they ever take it away, then I'll be sad. You rest area? I don't know if we can go in there. I think it's just here. I don't know. It's in the Sinbad stunt show area. Would you say this was like Universal Orlando's answer to Waterworld in Hollywood? Uh, like their stunt show that they had? I think it was more their answer to like the Wild Wild West stunt show. Uh, like it kind of had a more goofy vibe to it. Gotcha. Well, I think Waterworld had a goofy vibe a little bit. I mean, the Waterworld. bad guy had some corny jokes. Yeah, Waterworld has that kind of two minute segment of the Deacon making jokes, but I don't know. Uh, this, it gives me more of a Wild West stunt show vibe than a Waterworld vibe. Gotcha. Yeah, this is Special East Watch, so it's Oh. <laughs> wow. I've never been in here. This is cool. Yeah. They still got water. Yeah, they still got water. That's cool. <laughs> so this is Casbah, the talking fountain that talks to people. He's playing the chicken dance for this family. That's too funny. <laughs> Stepping into Hogsmeade and found where everyone's at. <laughs> so many people. So bad news. I'm a big guy. I tried the big seat, the test seats for Hagrid's, but Hagrid's is also down. So, eh. when two intellectual properties collide. Some guys working right there on the roller coaster. I hear them doing some sawing and welding. But our next attraction is going to be River Adventure, what we used to have in Hollywood. Now it's Jurassic World in Hollywood. It's our first time doing Skull Island, Reign of Kong. <clears throat> Q looks cool. I'm excited. Oh, geez, that is creepy. Cramming us in with another pony. Yeah, there's plexiglass on both sides, so we're like cattle. And uh, we're about to get on Skull Island. I gotta say, Reign of Kong was actually pretty cool. That was a lot better than I thought it was. But I think now we're gonna try and head to the other park via Hogsmeade Express. Because the other park closed in four hours and we haven't been there yet. Hagrid's is still down. So, we are walking through the express queue for 
Hogsmeade Express to the other park. Cross, London, mind the gap. We're now in Universal Orlando after a quick train ride. There's the night bus. The London Underground's right here. Closed, obviously. The tube. The tube. There's this random brick wall here that we can walk through. I don't know. Jalen has no idea what this is. Yeah. Ah, there's a dragon. Magic is happening. Magic is happening. From a side I've never been on before. And this is Jalen's first time on this. So cool. Unfortunately, lap bar wouldn't come down far enough. Um, there's like shin guard part of the lap bar that uh, it was in my legs and I couldn't fit. So Jalen and Tyler are on it. I'll wait for them. No biggie. I've been on it before. There they are. There they are. Yay! The amazing Alex is making more magic for us post ride because we didn't get to see the normal queue. She's bringing us in so we can see the bank with all the goblins. Look at that chandelier. So cool. Okay. <laughs> They're just some of them that right look like they're really going to That's so cool. Mm -hmm. I think this one, all the rides are based on the point systems. Yeah. So each animatronic will be worth a certain amount of points. These dudes are just one piece ten. Oh. oh no. If you're over ten, you cannot operate them. Oh yeah. Men in Black Alien Tech playing some Jaw Rule right now. Oh yeah. Brother Scott, Men in Black, shoot some aliens. Two hundred seventy-two thousand. Jay got eighty-six thousand. And we got Galaxy Defender. What? Oh no! I'm recording it, so... Tyler, what was your score? 520,275. Well, fine. <laughs> Walking through Springfield. That's it. We're going to ET, so... Nothing to see here, really. Freaking love that it's still here. And the time traveling train from Back to the Future Part 3. Love it. SpongeBob! I don't think I've ever been in this store. It's a cool store. Yeah, it is pretty cool. Squidward's house right here. Slightly taller than me. <laughs> yeah. This is cool. We totally forgot about this scarecrow stalk going in in this uh, this park. There's a bunch of scarecrows throughout shops and whatnot. This one's cool. It's Gary, and I'm in SpongeBob's house. It's a rave. Boonch, boonch, boonch. So unfortunately, ET the ride is down right now, but ET is right there. 
Wouldn't you know, it's Dora the Explorer. Dora the Explorer. And Diego. There's some dancers over there. Mel's driving. Yeah. I freaking love this because I love American Graffiti. Bunch of the cars from American Graffiti and the Mystery Machine? Huh. Interesting. You got Homer in there and his little RV. Uh, four nights is a thing now. Five minute wait? Holy crap. Let's go. Use a Rip Ride Rocket. And uh, I have not done Horror Nights here. My first ever Halloween Horror Nights was here in 2013. And then I did Hollywoods in 2014. So I'm glad they have some form of Halloween Horror Nights. We're witnessing a shift change in all the scare actors. So this is, this is all I'm gonna film. I'm not gonna film in the maze, but that's pretty cool to see the shift change. Well, I had a lot of fun in the Bride of Frankenstein house. That was, that was a lot of fun. So now we're gonna make our way over to Revenge of the Tooth Fairy, the other house. And then probably the tribute store and whatever else. Revenge of the Tooth Fairy, also a five minute wait. Yeah. Revenge of the Tooth Fairy, that was pretty good. That was pretty good, I liked both those houses, so. Uh, Good job, Universal. Thanks for HHN light or diet HHN. Thanks. Fingers crossed that I get on Revenge of the Mummy. I need row four, CA, big boy seat. I really forgot how intense that ride was. Uh, so much, so much more intense than the Hollywood one. Oh, I loved it. What'd you think? It was fun. It was fun. <laughs> oh, okay. I the headrest? Yeah. yeah. Did you hit your head? Spooky. Alright, I didn't record the houses, but I'll record the tribute store. Ah, Frankenstein's monster. Perfect. Cool. What is this? Franken mold? Ah. Getting a mold for six dollars. It's alive! <laughs> it's alive! Oh ah. my gosh. Hey, hold up. May remain upside down until yeah. cool. Like this? Got some glow into the dark. This is a cool room. There's Jack. That's cool. And now we're in the Beetlejuice room. I think this is the Beetlejuice room. I don't know if I made it to there yet. Oh. Oh, I think it's the next room. Okay. My bad. Whoops. How dare you. How dare I. Okay, now, now, it's showtime. So cool. Tell the audience again, what did you get? This is a bacon, cheddar, and scallion waffle stick. Oh, wow. yeah. That sounds good. Would yeah. you like... Them. You can take the end off. Okay. <laughs> I'm speechless. Why? I'm not gonna. It's a little, that's very nice of you. I'm not gonna have food and not share. Thank you. Yeah, might as well get to try us. I want to see the first reactions. Jalen's gonna take a bite too. Yeah. Complex. A lot of flavors. Yeah. It's pretty good. It tastes like bacon and waffles together. Good. Yeah? Cool. It's a SpongeBob dance party. Ah. Hi. <laughs> Where's Mary Poppins? Yeah, right? <laughs> Mary 
Uh, wrong. It may be dark, but ET phone home. Grab a bike, dudes. Oh, this is so cool. I'm glad to be back here. As we got off ET, Barney's over here. Jay wants a picture with Barney. <laughs> the water show right there playing Back to the Future music as we're passing back by the train in the DeLorean. Love it. All right, I haven't, I haven't been here in five years. This is a new attraction, but I'm smart enough to know not to go on this attraction. It's not worth it, but I wanted to see the cars. I'm a huge Fast and Furious fan, and this is good enough for me. Optimus, get inside my bumblebee. Okay, there's the globe. We're passing by it because we just left Universal, they closed. That didn't happen. <laughs> and we're going back to Islands of Adventure for a little bit. Walking back into Islands of Adventure because the wait for the Hogwarts Express was gonna be a long wait. So we just walked it. And we're here, 45 minutes ago. Superhero Island! It is a very smooth roller coaster. We're going to Spider Man. Because Hagrid's is a two hour wait. Nope. In line for Spider Man, they got all these cool Daily Bugle uh, news stories. There's Scream, one of the symbiotes. So cool. Um, so, here we are. There's Stanley. And yeah. <laughs> How's it going? How's it going, Tyler? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> it can only get better. <laughs> so we're moving and also Iron Man. Stark Solutions. <laughs> uh, this is great. Wow. If you ever wanted to see a ride with the lights on. <laughs> so that was a bummer that Spider-Man broke down, but it was an interesting experience. Jay says she already likes it more than Transformers, which is awesome. They gave us three ads, uh, uh, express passes to come back to any attraction by December 1st, except for Hagrid's. But we won't be back by December 1st, so we gave ours to Tyler. He'll be back in November, so yeah, we did that. Now we're going to go to City Walk, see if we can find some food. Maybe Margaritaville. Maybe. So we did put our names in at Margaritaville, but it's about an hour away. We're here at the Lone Palm across the way, which is part of Margaritaville. Right next to the plane. With lots of water, because it's hot. With a view of Islands of Adventure and sun setting. Jay and I are sharing the seafood mac, shrimp, and crab. I just had a bite, it's pretty good. Borzen sauce, yum. We are done with dinner, there's Lone Palm. There's the lighthouse for Islands of Adventure. We're gonna head back to the hotel, well back to our car, and then uh, go to the hotel. Gotta say, the, the seafood mac and cheese, which was shrimp and crab mac and cheese with horse and cheese sauce, was pretty good. It was good. It, it did the job. It filled me. It was tasty. Yum. But uh, not wow. But I enjoyed my time at Margaritaville. It was nice to be back at Margaritaville, even if it's not Hollywoods, but 
Yeah, it was good. It was really good. And tomorrow night, this is where we'll be dining. Big fire. I've heard really good things about this place, so I'm looking forward to that. This is so much different from this morning and so much nicer. Less people, moving walkways. I love it. Sharon and Monica from Orlando. Nice swing. Yes. I got a. So we made it to Aku Aku. First time in years for me and Jalen. Two years. Two years. So excited. So. So exciting. I'm getting a mug exclusive to Aku Aku. Tyler's getting one too. It's Creature from the Black Lagoon, but dressed as Fu Manchu. You cannot release this until they release it on the Instagram. Let me see where we have three seats exactly, because it is a little packed up there, and I'll be right back down. Okay? Sure. Okay. No worries. I will. So we are at a place. Well, the bar downstairs is called Bauhaus. But we are going to a place called Hanson's Shoe Repair. It's right there. Okay, so right there. The you need a you need a password to get in. So it's an open air patio. Like this top of building right there. This top of another one. Ah, this is awesome. So cool. Jay and Tyler are right there. Cocktails and Screams. It's a Halloween themed bar. We're in the Adams Family section. There's a portrait of the family right there. We got some loud music, of course, and then there's some ghosts over there floating above, and we're in some nice seats. What's up? I like so much younger in the darkness. Okay. The bar area is themed to Frankenstein. It's a monster. There's his head right there. And the bartenders are dressed up like dead Playboy bunnies. So cool. Gotta say, Cocktails and Screams here in downtown Orlando, that was so cool. The witch's bar in the back, like, they have a guy who was dressed as Dr. Facilier, which they got a guy dressed as Dr. Facilier. It was really cool. And you can either get like a a tick turn, tic a tincture, tincture, or a cocktail or an absinthe. But you just tell him what you like, and he just makes something up for you, like your top three fruits and your favorite alcohol. Like I said, tequila, and I said pineapple, mango, and orange. It was so good. This this camera looks nice. <laughs> yeah. Galaxy S20 Plus. So cocktails and screams. If you're here in downtown Orlando or at Disney World, I'd say make a trip to cocktails and screams. And Aku Aku. And Aku Aku, which is right down the street. Yeah. Yeah. This is our this is our list. Let's go. Goodbye. Thank you everyone for checking out the vlog. Have a great night. Have a Be great safe. Night. We'll see you for Volcano Bay tomorrow. And hello? Ah.